What is up, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Um, I have taken a little breather, you know, since the last time I've been on this. It was a short breather, you know. Hopefully, in this video, we will actually reach Kala. We've been platforming for like the... In the last, and if you've seen the last video, we were platforming for 40 some minutes. So here's hoping. Let me, let me try something else. Because I know you can dash and then pole jump, so let me try that. Nope, that didn't work. I really don't know what they expect of you here. I really don't know what they expect of you here, man, for real. I, I really would like to know what was the developer thinking when they when they made this platforming session. Did they think, oh man, dude, look at this awesome platforming idea? And I would also like to ask them, what was the whole point? How did any of this? Like, it, it would be a different story of, like, this is what Kala did to the landscape. But no, it's nothing like that. It's just, we want to make the player as annoyed as possible. I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm still trying to figure out what it is exactly I need to do. I'm still trying to figure out what it is I need to do. Cause uh, Evidently, it wants me to do something. And unfortunately, it looks like it's going to be another hour of platforming. I mean, I would like to know why I went straight through it that time. And that time as well. And see, that's what I mean by the inconsistency. I'm not going through it on the bottom half, but for some reason I'm going through it up here. The Pinnacle of Loka? Oh. 
Dar. Is that Dar? You. You killed me, Ashna. Uh, uh... After all the help I gave you, all the battles we fought together, you have nothing to say to me. It's not my fault. I couldn't control it. That's right. You can't control yourself. You are chaos. No, not anymore. You're weak, like your father. And if he were in front of me, I'd kill him all over again. How dare! No, this isn't Dar. Dar changed. I don't know what you are, but you are not him! Now hold up, boy. I say I might, boy, that took off a lot of damage for me, boy. But I was blocking them. Ajna, are you alright? I'm okay. I guess Kala is trying to hit me where it hurts. You didn't succumb to it. That's the important thing. Arsna, you failed me. Ender? Oh man, I don't know if I can handle this. Dad, I know you're not real, but... My feelings are quite real. You've never listened to me. You've never been a proper daughter. Worst of all... I sealed Kala away, and you let her out. All of this could have been avoided. <sighs> you were never good enough. You're not even my daughter by blood. I could never love a beast. <sighs> Don't listen, Ajna. You know it's not true. I know. It's just... Difficult to hear those words, things you've doubted about yourself, from someone who looks like your father. But I know it's not him. He cared for me in his gruff way. And I know we have to keep going. Who is that? Is this supposed to be like the young Ender that killed Kala away? How did I miss that? No, hold up, here. Yeah. I'm sorry, Dad. I know it wasn't you, but I'm still sorry. I'm gonna win this. For all of us. Ravanavar? So, come to revisit our past glories, have we? Ravanavar. You were the key to Kala's rebirth. Rejoice! She has become more powerful thanks to your senseless bungling. Soon you will rejoin her, and my vision will be complete. I don't have time for you. You're probably not even you! Yeah, get him, Ajna. If you want your heads chopped off again, I'm happy to oblige. Well, enough of that. Kala! Still holding on to the past, my lost little eye. No matter. I'm pleased you managed to make your way here. Kala, you're next! We'll see, won't we? I didn't make it easy for you, but you still managed to follow me here. Your power has grown. It's sure to augment mine when I absorb you. I can hardly wait. A 
I'll stop you here and now. I don't think so. I have barely begun to show you the extent of my power. Follow me and find out. That is, if you can. Why not fight me now? Why are you running away? I can do it. I think. Maybe. You can. This is what you've been waiting for. We're here with you. You can do it. Just look inside yourself. There is no limit to your power. Who's them supposed to be? Stop it! You have no power over me! True, I was a part of you once, but now I am Ashna! I am myself! So you let her say all that trash before you decided to say something back? My eyes. Uh, uh. Ajna, are you all right? Yeah, I feel pretty good actually. How many colors are you going to turn, show off? I feel really powerful, but I'm not angry anymore. That does not answer my question. It really didn't. Can you follow Kala? With my body and mind united, I think I can. Hmm. What? I get the feeling. Once I go up there to face her, I won't be able to come back. One way or another, this is it. It's me or Kala. You've learned divine will. While airborne, press and hold B to generate ED and shoot forth in the direction you choose. While airborne, press and hold. A chakra gate. The wheel completed. Oh, so I guess this opened up the last one. So if I if I had any side quests left to do, that would be it. But Ozma, yeah, look at that. Doesn't that look suspicious? Hmm, it does. You think the gates of Naraka are under there? Could be, or it could be a whole stash of bat guano. Either way, you better find out. What are you talking about? What is going on? Oh, 
Like... So now she dashes with some kind of weird power, but I, I'm not. Maybe, maybe this person right here will tell me what to do. You come to me for guidance, then let me see what I can do. What? The destined clash between you and Kala lies ahead on Mount Sumeru. How? Where am I supposed to go? He doesn't go up no higher than that. I'm ready. Let's finish this for good. You know what? If there was something I missed, I just missed it. I So I'm pressing slam it to the left. Like even after all this, I'm still doing platforming. Kawa, I'm here. So I see, and you appear to have gained a bit more power as well. But it doesn't matter. You are a part of me. You will inevitably rejoin the whole. I won't. I'm me. Hmm. What's this thing? Don't touch it. It's part of Kala. Ah. Uh, but don't you want to see what it does? You are beginning to test my patience. One squint and you'll never see the light again. Just try it. You're about the right size now. Maybe I'll just shove you back in. You talk big, but I'm still here. Nowhere in this world is safe from me. I made it. I can unmake it. Just let me eat you, or the world will be destroyed with you in it. She has 17 life bars? That's insane.
Why does she have 17 life bars, bro? Two hundred and sixty K, if not bad. So, what's the point in you? What's the point in you destroying? How much damage did that do? But why would, if you created this world, why do you want to destroy it? I was blocking. But I blocked though, I'm about to die. So I guess I have the perfect block now. Huh? And that's not gonna happen. Oh my gosh. I, I am, I am so drained. I am so like mentally drained. I do want to see how much damage that level was. Eight? Seven? Yeah, level seven does again. Yeah, so let me see how much, let me see how much damage this equals out to. Two million eight hundred thousand damage?
so the ground stomp doesn't do damage. She actually might be dead this round. actually growing growing this is my world I can be sealed I can be hurt but I cannot be defeated we've got to get somewhere safe nowhere in this world is safe from me I made it I can unmake it what was that? I don't know. It's like she reset everything somehow. So it's true. Nowhere is safe in the world. But my inner realm, that's like another world entirely. Just let me eat you, or the world will be destroyed with you in it. Are you serious? I am trying to like, I'm trying to keep, keep a, 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 a positive attitude, you know, I, I should be happy I got through the platforming, but like all of my, <laughs> all of my ability to what? Yeah, that doesn't do anywhere near. She's telling the truth. She will come back, again and again. I think I know what I have to do. If I can't defeat her from the outside, I will have to do it from within. Even if... Even if that means I can't see you all again. Everyone? I need to do this last part alone. I can't put you all in danger. 
Thank you for all you've done for me. So I guess now everybody's got something to say. It's been real, coach. Knock that gala lady into next week. I'm gonna try. You can do it, coach. Hi. We believe in you. We're your biggest fans. And if we ever see you again, there's always a spot on our team for you. Hi, guys. Put me on your team. Maybe you should just put her on your team. Well, you heard the coach. All right, Nuna, you're on the team. Hooray! No, Ashna, you can't go away. But I have to. No, why? To beat Kala. That's dumb. Hmm, it is dumb. It really is. Can we just go hang out instead? Yeah. Uh, I mean, no, I can't. I gotta do this. Well, if you don't come back, I'm gonna be super mad at you. So you'd better win. I'm gonna do my best. Team Idiot Forever! Yeah! Ajna, my friend. You've done so much for me. You helped me find Hussam. And now, I have a whole new family to care for. My brother, Elaine, and little Kadira. <laughs> I'm happy you found your people. It means you can have a family again. I'm a little jealous. When this is all over, please come visit us. I'm going to miss you, even the teasing. <laughs> well, if I visit you, there's gonna be some more of that. I know you can fix this. You can fix it for all of us. I'll try my best, Kadira. Thank you for all your help. I'll try, I'll try, I'll try. Where's the confidence at? First of all, second of all, I suggest you guys go look at the writing behind the... Uh... Well, let me not say that yet. Let me see what the ending is like. Ajna, is this really the end? Sure feels like it. I had so much more I wanted us to do together. But I'm glad I got to travel the world with you. I got to meet Angwu and Naga Rider. I never could have done it alone. I'm not so sure about that. You're pretty tough. <laughs> I guess a bit rubbed off from you. Nah, you've got your own toughness. Who was it that healed all our wounds countless times? Who was it that brought me back from the brink of death with resurrection lilies? Me, I guess. Yeah, and don't you forget it. Botany is tough stuff. You're right. Thanks, Ajna. Honey thanks you too. It's been fun, Ginseng. And you too, honey. Well, Hayseed, I'm not gonna say goodbye. <laughs> not the pirate way, eh? Not mine, anyway. We've traveled this whole wide world together, and seen places even I never dared visit. Well, thanks to you. Ah, I only played a small part. You're one tough youngster, and I'm happy to have had you and my crew. Aw, it was a pleasure. And thank you for joining mine as well. I suppose I did, didn't I? Well, happy to serve. Never thought I'd ever say that to anyone. But hey, uh, before you go, how about you put in a good word with Tarani for me, huh? What? Why? Aren't you two already close? Look, just do it, okay? Well, if it makes you happy. Oh, it does. Ajna, Luke so you are my precious baby child, and I can't bear to let you go. <laughs> but you know I've got to do this. I know it better than anyone. But wherever you go, whatever you do, whatever you become, know that I will find you and help you. Even if it takes me 1,000 years, I will find you. You're so nice, Tarani. I just care about you so much. I never had a mom, Tarani, but I think you'd make a real good one. Oh, look so. You're going to make my heart melt. Come here and let me hug you. Oh, God. Tarani, I can't breathe. So precious, my dear, sweet baby. <laughs> Take care, dear one. You too, Tarani. Thank you for everything. I wish you could see my face right now.
So that so basically everyone that's in this upper palace is going oh, there. Ajna. What a journey it's been for us both. Yeah, we met in jail. Well, that's an odd way to put it. <laughs> we did though. You were all ready to bust out of there and tell me how cool of a fighter you were? Uh right. I guess I did say something along those lines. Embarrassing, right? Even more so now that you're continually pointing it out. <laughs> well, I'm glad that we got you out of there. You've been a good friend. I know I've put myself out there as the tough guy, but I really am sad to see you go. Thank you for trusting me and believing in me, even when I didn't believe in you. We're friends, Zebe. We watch each other's backs no matter what. I'll see you again, kid. We'll see, I guess. Oh, and Ajna? Yeah? You have earned the great Zebe's respect. This does not come lightly. Do not dishonor us both by losing to Kala. <laughs> All right, I'll do my best. Again, Goodbye. I'll do my Ajna. best. I'll try. Goodbye, Zebe. I guess I'll do my best. You want to know what... And I, I, I don't want to bring up... Uh, Zell and... and, and old girl from Sea of Stars, but they never doubted themselves. Ashna, I'm not good with goodbyes. Aw, oh, I'm sorry, Kushi. It's okay. I mean, I thought it was my destiny to be a protector of Lan, but you helped me to protect the whole world. Well, it's not over yet. I could still fail. More doubt. You... That's nice of you to say, but I couldn't have done it without you. Um... You can visit Altoon anytime. I'll make more animal friends for you to visit too. Really? Thank you. Animals are so cool. I'm just really happy I got to be your friend. Uh, it's embarrassing to talk about. Oh, I'm happy too, Kushi. The world's gonna be alright if you're out there protecting it. Do your best. You got it. And thanks, Ajna. It's okay, Lanshi. You're a good dog. Kushi and Zebe will still be here to take care of you. Then... You take care of him too, you hear? <gasps> Dogs are good. I mean... <laughs> There's still some people over here. So, the big stage, huh? Looks that way. The whole world is cheering for you, you know? What an audience. That's a little intimidating. Ah, oh, it's the greatest thrill you can have. Now go kick Kala's brains out. Well, young miss, it seems this is where we part ways. This is it. Thanks for your help, old timer. Heck, you gave me purpose again. I should be thanking you. It felt good to be part of a team again. We were glad to have you. Take care of yourself. Likewise. Now go plug Kala right between the eyes. How about some training then? Huh? Let's put those muscles to work. Uh, can't say I didn't try. Take care. Yes and thank you. Yeah, get out of here, boy. Young one, your greatest challenge lies ahead. I know. That's why we're having all these goodbye conversations right now. Fear not the unknown. It shall become your strength. The will of the people is with you. How do you know that? A rider knows such things. Well, thanks for your help. You're an odd guy. You are the truest rider I have ever known. Your strength and riding skill knows no equal. I mistook you as an ordinary citizen when we first met. But now... I see the true gleam of the ride in your eyes. Thanks? Yes, thanks. And ride on, brave warrior. And I'm gone! Commander Shepard didn't doubt either, and that man fought monsters the size of buildings. Thank you again for helping us. Wait, what did I help you guys with? I'm glad to have you take care of yourself. You too, dear. 
So that's everybody over there. I'm just saying, Commander Shepard. What? Commander Shepard didn't know. Uh, he never doubted for a second that he couldn't beat the Reavers. But we're friends now, right? Oh, for sure. But you know, I'm kind of disappointed. What? Why? Well, I kind of thought there'd be some nice loot up here. You can't steal. No, no, I totally can. Well, you shouldn't. Hmm, we're gonna have to agree to disagree on that one. Catch you in the next cycle, friend. Take care, Kampan. Don't steal anything while I'm gone. I'll take that under advisement. That's not an okay. That's a... Oh, Ajna, do you really have to go? Yeah. Aren't you scared? Yeah. I wish you didn't have to go. Please be careful. Oh, and I'm planning a big feast for when you come back, so you work up a big appetite, okay? With all your favorite foods laid out on a giant table, with everyone invited. It's all I can think of to help. Wow, that sounds great, Leilani. But... Mm. More doubt. It's just... Now I'm hungry. Uh. Oh! Oh, I'm sorry! Ah, uh, now I've got to beat Kala while thinking about Pempek. <laughs> I just learned how to make a mean cuckoo too! So you've got to come back! My poor empty stomach. You're a strange one, Ajna. What? what Not in a bad way. It's just, you were out here trying to save the world, and you still took the time to help a fellow traveler repair her oud. Oh, that? It was no big deal. It was a big deal to me. Someday, I will capture that compassion in song, and sing your praises till the ends of the earth. That's nice of you, Zara, but I don't need all that. Let me just see here. Something like... Why are you crying? Hey, Ajna. You showed my children what it means to be a true warrior. You've helped ensure the future of my kingdom. Yeah. I didn't do all that. You did that and more. You're the fiercest warrior I've met. I'm proud to have known you. Well, the feeling is mutual. Take care of yourself, Phoebe. Come visit my kids again after you beat Kala. I want to see what new tricks you've learned. It's a deal. First bit of confidence yet. Well, Ajna, it's been a whirlwind trip for all of us. To think the fate of the world rests on your shoulders. No pressure. I wish I could take your place. A shy at night does not back down from a conflict. Well, I appreciate the thought, but... I know. This is a fight between the gods. It is no place for a mortal like myself. But, know this. Whatever happens, your story will be told for generations. I will make sure of that. And a shy at night fulfills his promises. Thanks, Tungar. Take care of yourself. Ajna seems we've reached the limit of our research. Yes, we've taught you all we can. Thanks for your help. May we meet again in another life. My dearest little Ajna. Please don't say that. Uh, temper? Well, Ajna. It has been a pleasure watching you fix this world and make my job irrelevant. Happy to do it. Now, if only you would put in a word with some of your compatriots so that we might get to know each other a little bit more intimately. I won't. Such a difficult one. Bye, Ren. Thanks. Toodles.
And I mean, really, this is the only character I actually care about. Jin singing in the cool, Naga Rider is cool. Um, let's see, Tungar is okay. Phoebe was cool. But really, to me, the main character was really Rosmi. Rosmi? I can't talk to you right now. But we've got to say goodbye at least. No, I don't want to. But I've got no choice. Listen, I don't care about this world. I never did. But then you came along and swept me up into your dumb nonsense. <laughs> Sorry about that. No, just don't leave me behind. I don't like anybody else. I never liked anybody. And now I like you, even though I don't want to. And you're leaving, and I don't even know what I mean when I say that I like you. This is so embarrassing to talk about. I just want to set you on fire. I'm sorry. You don't get it. I like you too, Rasmi. I'm glad we're friends. That just makes it worse. Well, go then. See if I care. I'm happy I met you, Rasmi. Go away. I know you're not coming back. But your soul might. If it does, I'll find it and trap it. And then you'll never get away. That's the old Razmi. Well, that's everybody. So now what? Do I just go out of my uh, realm? Ashna, you're late. Dad? Ashna. A solid defense is the root of any proper combat strategy. This is training, Ashna. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Ashna, Ashna, Ashna. You're strong. Now the best do is I could have asked for. And the best not. I know I've been hard on you. I know I haven't been the kindest father. I don't want to be that guy. This 48 minutes now, we still ain't fought the final boss. But don't worry, Ashna. Death isn't the end. Thanks, Dad. Ew. This courage now. I can't back down. I've made mistakes. But there are people who are counting on me. People who care about me. When I have to go inside the head? That is disgusting. Okay. Now it's just us. I'm coming, Kala. What? What are you doing? I'm gonna merge with you after all. So, you finally understand. No, it's you who doesn't understand. I'm doing this to destroy you. My power will defeat you from within. Why must you interfere? This world is my greatest failure. If so, it is a beautiful failure. And I will not let you destroy it. How dare you? How dare you? A hundred and... I must achieve perfection. You won't survive. Even if you are a part of me. A hundred and eight life bars.
What am I supposed to be doing here? Maybe we weren't related by blood, but he was my father. He cared for me in his own way. Flaws are what make us human. You are not human. That's what I was about we to are say. Not human. We are above human. I've been raised by humans, lived among humans. I never knew I was anything else until just recently. Being human is beautiful. No! It's base. It's crass. It's imperfect. I will make it anew. You will not survive this. I will. Someone important to me taught me how. Activate flowering defense. Okay, Ashna. This is it. Enough of that. <laughs> I can't move. I couldn't move. What was I supposed to do? Bro. I'm about to turn this game off again. But I got a perfect block. Dude, what did I? I'm sorry. I gotta pause it right here. Shut up. Game developers, please tell me what did I level up for? What did I level up for? I, you know what? There better be some type of fight here. Because if the final boss is having to perfect block everything, then I ask the question, what did I level up for? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enough of that. I'm done, bro. I'm sorry, I'm done. So I can't use any of the abilities I've learned.
this is in, this is actually insane. I, I'm not gonna lie, this is actually insane. I mean, I don't know what to tell you. I, I'm pressing, I'm pressing block, and it's simply just not working. Like she's getting hit anyway, so. I just tried to hit her, so apparently. I have to perfect block everything. I'm gonna tell you right now though, I, 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 I might as well just turn this video off because with, with, with my current my current state of mind, I'm not going to beat this. I see. That voice in my head. Somehow, I knew it was you. I thought you were trying to make me doubt myself. But those were your own self-doubts, weren't they? Ugh. You were angry with yourself for restarting the world so many times, and failing to create it as you envisioned. My doubts are not yours to see. But they are. Because they are mine too. So you see why the world must be perfect. No. They're my doubts because I'm not perfect. 
and neither are you. And aren't flawed beings more interesting? Look at all the people who helped me get here. The people who surprised you again and again. Isn't that beyond perfection? But I've failed them. I've failed myself. I've failed this world. Look at all the pain and suffering the people go through. But they get through it together. They work hard and push through adversity to create something wonderful in the end. Sometimes adversity is what helps them make something beautiful. Maybe in the odd case. But I've made them suffer so. And they will keep on suffering until I end it. A new world is the only way. How many times have you reset the cycle? I've lost count. And has it ever been close to perfect? I suppose it hasn't. Maybe. Maybe we write this one out and see where it goes. You can't change your mistakes, but you can learn from them. I suppose true enlightenment can't be achieved from changing what's external to you. It must come from within. I know you've been going through this alone. That's why you've been so angry. I know, because I can feel it too. <sighs> but you're not alone now, Kala. I'm here. The small piece of you that was forgotten, but has come back to remind you in your darkest hour. You're not alone. Even by yourself, you're not alone. I'm here. I'm part of you. So... I will merge with you. On one condition. We reincarnate. Together. And see what this world holds. Not by making it perfect from the outside. But by doing our best from within. But you speak so passionately of your friends. What of them? I'm not sad to leave the life I've led. It was wonderful, and I couldn't have asked for more. The next will be even better. I'm sure of it. I want to see what happens to this world I love, and the people I love. Don't you? Oh. I do. Thank you, Ajna. So they rebuild Lon.
Are they gonna show any? Um, I'm about to say, are they gonna show anyone? Also, Bomb came back to life. How? Well, I mean, she trapped his soul in a jar. I guess she could have just put it back in his body. Boutsai is drinking her life away, like, I guess. So the little baby is growing up into a toddler, it seems. And yet Jensen, oh, he's he's there with Anru, okay. So he's in the Tower of Wisdom now. He buried his old friend that he took out with one bullet. Well, it looks like his gun, so he might have left his weapon there too. Naga Rider. I guess Ren is back at his hometown again. Stephanie Shea, or whatever her name is, did an amazing job. I see a name up there I did not see throughout the whole game, so I'm assuming that's the character I didn't get. Zbotch and Hunots are back out there uh, playing whatever that ball game is. And Nuna, who's supposed to be a member of the team, is just nothing, is there for nothing but to cheer them on. So that's the ending, huh? It appears that Ajna becomes Kala's third eye again, and then they reincarnate into a flower while everybody else continues to live. So let me get this straight. Kala's been resetting the world for thousands of years because she was lonely. Lon, she, oh, so the baby grew up. The girl grew up. The Azura, I guess they call it, grew up. But she was lonely and didn't know how to express her feelings, so she just killed everybody and recreated the world for thousands of years. So many times that she lost count because she didn't know how to express the fact that she, that people were making other folks suffer in the world. You gave them free will and with it they chose to dominate and, and put people in pain and stuff and you blame yourself so you destroy the entire world and rebuild it. So I guess Phoebe and Tungar decided to become a thing and all this time all she needed was wait did they did she steal her ship but you're telling me this whole time all she needed was a friend so Tarani and Mara Mara are helping people but the whole time, instead of Ender and them, oh, that's Kadira. Kadira and little Kadira, I guess you could say. So this whole time, instead of fighting Kala for centuries and sealing her away, you just had to offer to be her friend. So what happened to Ravanavar? He just died. He got pieced up twice and then just died. What happened to Dar? I guess Jan is is dancing at the at the Mara's den with her dad. 
But what happened to Dar? Like, so that's it. Dar just, I, I, I get he killed the old dude. Oh, uh, she cut his hair off. I guess trying to learn his weaponry, she cut his hair off. And Kampan is stealing yet again. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm trying really hard. I really am. I really am. So from what I understand... Aizuna, even with all that power, realized she could not kill Kala. But apparently Kala couldn't kill her either. So they just decided to be friends. They just decided to be friends and let the world be. And what exactly is she reincarnating into? I, 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 there was not enough there to understand what I went through all of this for, honestly speaking. It's like if Frieza killed all the Namekians and then killed Vegeta and Goku goes Super Saiyan and right when Frieza is about to die, he's like, dude, I did all of this because I wanted somebody my power level to hang out with and train with. And Goku's like, well, all you had to do is ask me. Come on, let's go ahead and train. Kala has killed billions of people because she didn't have a friend? Billions, billions, that's billions with a B, billions. And it's because she didn't have a friend, bro? Tell me I'm mistaken, please tell me I'm mistaken. Who is that? Is that supposed to be Ozna or their reincarnation? That's supposed to be their reincarnation? Wait, that's Anru Ender? And that's Ozna's mom. What is this? Wait, that's not Ozma's mom, that's the girl who used the axe. I'm pressing right bumper, why is it not letting me do anything? Wait, is this starting the whole game over? Yeah, because she's sealed in the shell. So this is just the, the, the intro again. Good morning, Roti. <laughs> ah, what a lovely day to blow off practice. 
I know, I know. I wouldn't really skip training. <laughs> so I don't have any of my abilities or anything like that. So yeah, I guess that's it then. Yeah. Only difference is it looks like that's not her regular hair color. It looks like her hair color is purple now. As opposed to... I, I, I heavily doubt it was purple before. But yeah, that is going to be it for me. Um, and that's it for Indivisible. I'm left with so many questions. Um, if that's all it took to stop Kala from destroying the world... What was all of this for? Like, I, I... Seriously. If that's all it took to stop Kala from destroying the world, what was all of this for? That's going to be it for me, folks. Um, at least I finished it. I'm... 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 I'm I'm trying to end without addressing the developers of this game because everything was good up to a certain point and then things just started, things just stopped making sense. First thing to stop making sense. Um, what was the point of Ender telling you death is not the end twice? And yet... For some reason, that has no meaning. Like, you never see Ender again. You never see Dar again. And I, I guess you do see uh, Ozna reincarnated fully with Kala again back at Oshwat. So I guess that's the ending at that point. Um, and you get to see what everybody else is doing. Bout size drinking, Lon is back, etc., etc. But I don't know. I just feel like all of that was for nothing. If all it took to get Kala to stop destroying the world was to be her friend. So if I'm mistaken, please let me know. But Kala's, I mean, not Kala, but Ozna's like, I can't destroy you, and I know I can't destroy you, but you can't destroy me. So rather than fight each other and destroy the world, let's join together and see how the world turns out. And it's like, at that point, what was the point of all of this? I What did I level for? I was like level 6 what, I, I don't even know what level I was But I was high enough To one shot monsters At the end of the game Doing 2.8 million Points of damage And I asked the developers what did I level for when the final boss has to be beaten with nothing but perfect parries? What did I level for?